Hello everyone, myself Dr. Vaishnavi Pardesi and I'm from Pune. Hello everyone, I'm Dr. Jensen Jacob and I'm from Chhattisgarh. So today here we are to uh, discuss with you the journey that we started. So we started our journey of becoming doctor from Transworld Educare which is in Pune and later on we went to We, we went to Philippines at uh, the DMSF which is uh, in Davao city. So uh, to begin with Yes, it was a difficult journey, obviously, and uh, the transfer educator has always been uh, support. And uh, to start with it, we already studied our first uh, year medical uh, subjects over here. That was anatomy, biochemy, biochemistry, and uh, physiology. So this helped us in our first year of uh, DMSF. And uh, later on, it was a hard journey. So that will be explained by my friend. So at DMSF. Uh we had uh, best in class faculty and uh, best facilities uh, we get a hands on on every subject and the doctors are really nice to us and they really care that uh, we study more and we learn more and uh, even in our fourth year uh, we got hands on experience uh, at the local hospitals at dmsf itself and the local local hospitals so it helped us uh, with our exam here uh, with the FMG exam. So uh, I cleared uh, with the score of 174. And uh, to discuss mine, uh, even I experienced a great uh, pleasure over there in Philippines where we learned a lot and the fourth year was a complete clinical knowledge based experience. So that helped me clear my FMG exam in first attempt with a score of 162. I would also like to mention that this was a whole soul preparation of mine where I self prepared and the college was a main source which helped me to crack the exam. Uh, we would also like to thank Dr. Uh, our Dean over there and uh, Sir Pillai who has been a support. Uh, so without David Pillai sir it wouldn't have been possible to enter into medical uh, facilities. And also if anyone wishes to uh, study from abroad, Philippines is a good option and in that I would like to mention the Law Medical School Foundation which has always uh, has a greater score in FMG and almost the ratio of passing of students in FMG is almost 70%. So even this year uh, we have seen that most of our friends have passed with a good rank and yes so. Even after, F, uh, if, even after the medical studies in uh, DMSF uh, you don't have to worry uh, of uh, by coming back and uh, thinking and preparing for the exam because you can uh, join Kings and uh, from there you you will get the best facilities which is the campus is in Chennai and uh, I personally studied there and which uh, which helped me to uh, get a good score of 174 and uh, the facilities there and the faculty there are very nice. Yeah, you have a hostel in the campus itself and the hostel itself is a very huge uh, the, the campus itself is a very huge campus and uh, you have everything in it so you don't have to worry about anything.